independent variable. <laughs> it's not independent variable. It's internal validity, folks. Yeah. yeah I was like, uh, <laughs> oh, wow. Well, whoopsie. <laughs> That was not an example. That was just a genuine mistake. Um, internal validity, the extent to which the experiment um, did what it was supposed to do. Did it rule out confounds? Did the effect observed really have to do with the independent variable? All right. So internal validity. Are we, are we doing what we intend to do with our experiment? Are we measuring what we intend to measure? Are you manipulating what you intend to manipulate? Are, do you have an actual experiment? Or did you just set up a little twinky little A-B design? Twinky? Whatever. What? Hinky. There's the word I was looking for. Hinky little A-B design, um, so, which isn't experimental. So if you set up a quality experimental design like an A-B-A-B design, uh, then we'll probably have internal validity, assuming you manipulated the independent variable well and you ruled out confounds, right? So then you have quality internal validity. You can have some confidence that the findings that you have um, have some basis in reality, uh, so, which allows you to draw more conclusions about the power of your independent variable.